Christmas is coming and today we are going to be making something awesome. We are going to use these things right behind me on this table here to make our very own talking pink <laughs> nightmare from a Christmas story. I searched the internet to find everything we need to make this happen. We've got the official Red Rider Carbine Action 200 shot range model air rifle. We've got Ralphie's pink bunny suit from Aunt Clara. It's got the ears, the mitts, and the bunny slippers. We've got two pairs of Ralphie's glasses and I'll explain those in a little bit here. We've got motion sensor speakers and we've got this major award which says Fragile. Actually, it's not a major award. It's a 12 year old boy mannequin, that sounds weird, that I found on eBay that looks exactly like Ralph Parker. Now, if you guys have not been watching Saturday Night Snack in a movie, make sure you follow the link in the description below and come over to that channel because we are getting ready to do a complete Christmas makeover downstairs in my home theater. And this Ralphie pink nightmare that we are making today is going to be part of the decor down there. Now I wanted this to look as authentic as it possibly can, so when I went searching for the suit, I looked for one that matched the screen suit as best as it possibly could. So this one you can see has the giant ears. It has the mitts, and it has the bunny slippers. I absolutely love those things. Look at the look of the face on those bunnies. I think this is probably the best suit I could get. This is an adult size suit, I believe. Yeah, one size fits most. And the reason I wanted an adult suit is because if you remember, in the movie when he comes walking down the steps, the suit is absolutely gigantic on him and it just kind of hangs. It just looks way too big for him. So I wanted to make sure that that's how this would look. Now the suit did come with a pair of glasses that look like Ralphie's. There are no lenses in these glasses here. So I bought a second pair. Not that it really matters all that much, but like I said, I want it to be authentic. So there are actually lenses in there, and I was kind of considering shattering one of those lenses, like maybe actually shooting it with a BB gun. Or I suppose I could just take like a hammer and a nail, put the nail on there and just tap it a little bit. I just want it to be shattered like his glasses in the movie. Now these are motion sensor speakers. These are actually solar powered. I can set this out in the sun and it will charge it up, or you can plug it into your computer and charge it up. And you can record whatever sounds you want on here. So my plan is to put something on here that Ralphie says. Maybe something like when he says, be sure to drink your Ovaltine. I think that would be hilarious. But regardless, this will be set up so that when you walk by, it'll trigger the speaker and you will be able to hear what Ralphie says. The Red Rider BB gun. I wanted this to be as close to screen accurate as it could be as well. Obviously, we're not going to be able to get one from that time period, but this is the actual design on the box when he opens it on Christmas morning, and if I turn it sideways, you can see it even has the same design on the side. So that is as close as we can get to Ralphie's BB gun. And last but not least, what is apparently going to be an amazing mannequin. I did not open it yet, but when I was looking for one, I was looking for one that actually looked like Ralph Parker. And guys, if this thing looks half as good as it does online, we are in for a treat. So let's go ahead and open this first because I am dying to see what it looks like. So this came from American Dress Forms on eBay, Bing International. I paid 145 bucks for this thing, so it better look good. This appears to be a leg. Look at this, it's all individually wrapped. This is probably an arm. That is heavy too. Ooh, this is the torso with the head. The face is what I really want to see. Oh my gosh, they have some kind of a weird mask on it. Look at that, that is actually creepy. <laughs> Like we got Nacho Libre wrapped up in there. Another leg here. This is probably parts to make it stand up. And a metal base, I'm assuming this is. And I think that's it. I will tell you though, I've had several mannequins and this is very well built. Look at the fingers on that thing. That looks like a real hand. Even the toes have toenails. This is the part I'm really excited about though. I cannot wait to see the face on this thing. And that totally cracks me up how they just have that mask on there like a ninja turtle <laughs> here we go there's the back of it oh my gosh there's the ninja turtle face okay first of all i don't think this is the one i ordered that looks pretty good 
But the one I ordered, I swear, had his hair like hanging down straight. But that does look pretty dang good. That is Ralphie's haircut right there. Look at that, he even has eyelashes. And that look on his face is perfect for what we're making. Because he is not happy that he has to wear the pink nightmare suit. So we got a hole in the foot, we got a hole in the back of the leg here, and we have our base. So this part can go up through the bottom of the foot, or we can put this on. And this goes back through the ankle. I guess it just depends if you want to have shoes on them or whatever. So if you were wearing shoes, these would fit right down over it. Look at the face on that thing. That is too funny. This is going to be hilarious. So I'm actually going to have to put this thing together and get it at least half dressed before I show you. Because otherwise everything's going to have to be blurred out. All right, that doesn't look too bad so far, but I do think I want to break one of these lenses. Oh yeah, there we go. Much better, look at that. Now we got the BB hole and the cracks. All right, so there is our Ralphie in his bunny suit. Oh my gosh, this thing is crazy and awesome. Now, I will say this. I bought the adult suit so that it would be like huge on him, but it is definitely not necessary. It looks good, but I had to do a lot of tucking to make it look right. Like the arms are so long, I had to tuck it into the mitts. Those shoe covers are absolutely enormous, so I just kind of pulled them behind and twisted them up back there, tucked them into the pants. But it turned out looking really good. I tried my best to form the ears like what it really looks like in the show, and that turned out really good. I do wish the hair was the straight hair. It's wavy and it still works because that is Ralphie's haircut. But I'm also really happy about the way that the glasses turned out. I just took the drill and put a little hole through there, cracked the glasses, and it looks like he shot his eye out. So speaking of shooting his eye out, let's go ahead and get this Red Rider over there. And there we go. How hilarious is that, guys? That is so awesome. And it gets me so excited about getting the whole basement remodeled for Christmas. Check that out. That is so totally awesome. And there's one more thing to do yet. I'm going to look up some of Ralphie's sayings on the internet. We're going to record it onto this. We'll just set it right here for the time being. And then whenever you walk by, you will hear Ralphie talk. Okay, so it was a lot more difficult to find something that I could actually record on there, but I got something good, and as soon as I move up here, it's it should kick on, so let's see. Okay, Black Bart, now you get yours. And that will just repeat over and over until I stop moving. <laughs> okay, Black Bart, now you get yours. So there he is, that turned out totally awesome. Ralphie in the pink nightmare bunny suit with his Red Rider BB gun. Make sure you guys come over to the Saturday Night Snack and a Movie channel, subscribe, and very soon you're gonna be seeing Ralphie with his Red Rider down there when I remake the whole basement to be a Christmas paradise.